Day three bloods. You will hear that at every fertility clinic and even the regular gynecologist. We need to draw your blood when you're on your period. So you come in on day three. We are drawing your FSH, your LH, and your estrogen level. And you need all three done together. FSH and estrogen, LH and estrogen, they interrelate. A high FSH, that's what we don't want to see. As the ovary gets older, you're cracking the horse harder. It's an old horse. You need more FSH to make the ovary go. So a high FSH is bad. But sometimes we have a nice normal FSH. Hooray! And then you look at the estrogen level and it's 300. It's not really a normal FSH. That high estrogen has pulled down the FSH. It's kind of the same thing. If the ovary starts growing the egg early, the estrogen goes way up really fast. And that's another sign that things are changing in that ovary. We want a normal FSH four to eight. Above 12, eh, we're starting to worry. We want an estrogen under 50. And LH should be around the same as FSH, maybe a little bit higher or a little bit lower, but pretty close. 